That's what I've had to learn myself. Yeah is that, that I would always, and it even says this in a, in a certain program, right? It says something to the effect of uh, by, by uh, making them different, mm -hmm. uh, that's, it's a problem because when you say, oh, alcohol is different from yeah. X, Y, and Z, they're, they're both mind-mood-altering substances. Yeah. And like you said, I would justify it as, oh, I've never had a problem with alcohol. Yeah. But the issue is that when you take a mood-mind-altering substance, it makes you want to do more mood-mind-altering. Oh, yeah. yeah, and so yeah. that's what I've had to learn through some good sponsors and is that for me too it's just got to be everything yeah. you know um and so when did you for were, initially was it like that for you were you like okay i can't do anything or did you try to drink and you know what i mean no so i'm not one of those you know like you hear about a lot of addicts talking about like that they that they they were just done and they you know they wanted to quit yeah. that's not my story i was oh. kind of i was kind of forced I'm not gonna say forced, right? I was at the end of the road to where I felt like I was tired of living the way I was living. I was tired of doing the things I was doing. I just, I wasn't ready to stop getting high, right? So yeah. I, my my situation was I had gotten trouble with the law and I had gotten put on probation and yeah, I wasn't doing very well on probation. So I was sent how to, old were so, you? Uh, I was I got clean at 29 years old. So 29.